Hey guys, how you doing? I hope you are doing well. This is Epson Expression Home XP2200. This printer is multifunctional printer. It's multi-tax, 3-in-1, in the sense you can copy, scan, and print with this printer. Check my video. You see how we connected this printer to Wi-Fi network. We scan document with this printer, printed this document out, okay? And also, we copied from this printer. What I want to show you is I received this question how to print from Epson printer. You can print with this printer in basically two forms. Okay, either you download Epson Smart Panel, okay, or make sure that, but I want to show you the other way, okay, for you to do this. For you to print from your Android and this printer, even if you did not connect this printer using Epson Smart Panel. So what you need to do is, first of all, you need to go to the document, okay? What we need to do, you need to go to your file, the document you want to, but make sure this printer and your mobile device are connected to the same network. It's what you need to do. Make sure both are connected to the same network for you to be able to find this printer and print with it. Now, to do this, we need to go to the file. So this printer and my mobile device, both are connected to the same network. We need to go to the file. So when, once you go to the file on your mobile phone, okay, you can select whatever you want to print out. You can see image, video, audio file, documents, download. So I want to go to documents. Okay, select documents and it give you, you can see these are the documents okay on my file on my mobile phone okay now i want to print out this document so this document we want to print out are two documents okay this is the first one two documents are in here to print out this document what you need to do is go to the top okay you, you see three dots select on the three dots okay once you select on the three dots it gives you the option what you will see is page sorter, page view, full screen, add to, tag, save as a file or print. Okay, so select print. And once you select print, you will see this option. Now it's telling us this printer is available. So the printer that was here is before is MG3600 series. Now what you need to do is use the down arrow to add a printer okay and the next you need to do is add a printer okay you can see cloud print hp service default printer service and canon so select all service okay then the printer we are using is epson printer so you can see epson print enabler install epson print enabler Okay, Epson Print Enabler lets you print with Android version 7 or later. Okay, you can see, click it open. Okay, agree to terms and condition. Now, Epson Print Enabler, welcome. How to print. Okay, you can see, just tell you the information. Okay, uh, be sure to... Uh, be sure to uh, enable Epson printer in the Android device print setting if you are app that support Android. Okay, so now what we need to do is we need to go back again. Okay, so select the document, go to the file. Okay, open the file, select the document you want to print. Okay, and here is the document again. Go to the dot, select print. Okay, and now scroll down you can see epson sp220 is showing select on it here we go okay here we go you can see the printer i just need to wait for this printer to be ready and it's ready this is the printer xp2200 and the next you need to do is if you want how many copies you want to print okay you can select how many copies if you want to select print more than two copies then you need to scroll 
change it to two copies, zero two. Now color. If you want it to print black and white, okay, or color the select colored. Now this printer, okay, the option for you to print two sided option is not. You can see none. Now the other thing is um, paper size. You scroll down if it's four by six or letter or any particular one. Okay, A4 paper, then you select A4 paper. Orientation, you can have it portrait, landscape. I usually like it, depend on how you want the okay. Landscape is it will be in, kind of in square format, portrait, it will be in, pretty much like A4. Okay, so I want it to portrait. Okay, now page size, all page range of two okay range of two or if you want to select particular one then if you want to only print to only page one then you select page one you can see okay but if you want this page this document is two page so if you want to print all then you select all page or if you want to print only one then you select print one put the number or if you want to print page two only then you select page two so okay you print only page two and i want to print all Okay, so I want to print all page. Okay, select all page. And you can see more option, which is quality, standard, layout, borders, and license, and any other thing. Then after that, okay, if you want quality, you have the best draft and standard, okay, for you to choose. Then go back. Okay, so it's in, at the moment it's in standard, and this is with borders. If you want it borderless, then you select borderless. Okay, cancel. So at the moment it's in borders. This is license. Then you go back. The next you need to do is uh, select print. Use Epson enabler. Okay, so this document now is sent to this printer and it's showing us printing. There we go. Okay, so this document is just showing you printing Samsung because my phone is Samsung. Okay, just show you printing Samsung Note. Okay, so now this document is printing. So like if you want to cancel this job you can select cancel okay but this is the print job if you want to cancel it then you select cancel to cancel it this is the first one okay the first document we printed out so the second one is coming The reason it's taking a bit time is because we are printing colored okay so if you want it to be a lot quicker then you need to select black and white black and white is 8.8 .8 print per minute in terms of the printing speed but for color is 4.0 okay four print per minute Okay, done. So this is the document we printed it out. Okay, okay. This is the document we printed out. So the document I'm going to cancel is more than two documents inside. So what we selected is to print all. 
okay you can see it's cancelled okay so this is how to this is how to print your document okay and uh, the other option i want to show you is another option to for you to print the document is for you to other way is for you to go to epson smart panel uh, okay if your printer is connected to the same network using epson smart panel then you go to epson smart panel and look for the doc this is epson smart panel i want to show you so this is epson smart panel okay okay and here it is so you go to print document okay and select print document then you go to the where you save the document and select on it okay and for you to go to, this is the document we have here okay inside epson smart panel select print this will give you more option for you to see okay like the same pretty much the same thing but this one is a lot clearer for you to see all the features okay printer settings for you to print how many whatever you want to print okay like printing range paper source media type so this one got more in depth okay more okay the quality paper source and everything and, and also you can change the color okay so these are the, another way to do this okay if you want to print black and white you select black and white for instance okay and also select you can also select print paper range if you select only start only page one so you cancel paper range select only page one okay and end in page one okay you can see one start from page one and end page one okay if you want to print only one page then select start and this document now is going to print out only page one Okay, can see. Can cancel it. Okay. So this is the document we printed out. Just I cancel the second page. Okay, this is to show you how this work. Okay. And if you're happy, you can see the print range. Okay, so you select instead of so the once you select the page range okay you select done okay instead of leaving it on okay at the moment so we have printed the document here and in two formats in two ways you can print the document if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe it help the channel thank you